This week in chess, America is making a concerted effort to buy top foreign chess players in an attempt to win next year's chess Olympiad gold medal for the first time in decades. That's right. The United States is buying up nerds, nerd mercenaries, nerd scenarios. For more, we welcome back our senior international correspondent, Mr. Trevor Noah. Trevor! A pleasure. Thank you. Very delighted to have you here. Thank you very much, John. It's an absolute pleasure to be back here to talk about chess. <laughs> the game of kings, smart checkers, black and white horsey squares. The history of chess stretches back centuries. Oh, come on, John. What? John. That, what? I'm sorry. Come on. I'm sorry. I just. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize how boring chess was until someone else started talking about it. Uh, all right. No, look, I mean, if Americans are so bored by chess, then why are you stealing everyone else's players? Uh, we'd like to win. We would like to win. Uh, I mean, let's face facts. We could patiently build a homegrown chess team through years of hard work, but, uh, years of hard work. Um, <laughs> we, we'd rather just buy them. You know what, John? Does America really need to be the best at everything? I mean, you already dominate the world in economics, military power, obesity. That, well... <laughs> You're very kind. We have the most Dakotas. You've got so many Dakotas. You yes. Got, well, what is it? North, North South, South, Fanning, Johnson. Yes. Leave some Dakota for the rest of us. <laughs> it is not like America has not had chess greats of its own. Uh, you had a, uh, uh, what was that movie? Uh, Bobby Fischer. Yeah, but that was what, 40 years ago? No, I just rented it. It was, um, <laughs> and Deep Blue, the IBM chess computer? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the parts came from China. All right, Trevor, what, what if we don't buy players? What if we don't buy them? It's just free market. This is how it works. No, John, it's not. This is a sport, kind of. <laughs> right? This is not meant to be an economic transaction like buying a loaf of bread or, or, or a seat in Congress. That hurts. America is supposed to be all about earning victory. Do you remember that movie where a guy from Philadelphia punched a Russian so hard it ended the Cold War? <laughs> What if instead of training Rocky to fight Ivan Drago, America just hired Ivan Drago? It's a way worse movie. That would be a totally awesome movie. <laughs> Fish out of water, communist in a capitalist country, but he learns how to love America and teaches his landlord how to make borscht. Like, it's such a good movie. It would, it would be a good movie. Thank I, go, you. I can't get the cab. That's Come what on. I'm talking about. It would be. Okay. I would like to go to the embar table. <laughs> nice. Oh, I love it. But you know what, John? I don't even think that this is about chess. This is about Russia. Because what's the only thing Russians love more than filming their own car accidents? <laughs> land, land grabs, no, I guess? No, John, or... no. Chess. They have more world champions than any other country. Who's their current champion? Oh, well, officially, Putin. I mean, uh... <laughs> Come on, we all remember that famous photo. Oh! You know what's weird? I always thought he was on a real horse. You don't look because you just see the nipples. You don't realize. That's true. But here's my point. America's been trying to get back at Russia for stealing Crimea, or, you know, warring with the Ukraine, mm -hmm. supporting Assad. You've tried everything. Yes. Sanctions, diplomacy, passive-aggressive subtweets. Nothing's worked. Yes. So now, you're trying to take Russia's place as, a, as the world's chess superpower because you know that would really hurt them where it hurts. Right in the pawns. It's just... There's... <laughs> They're just so mean. I just hate them so much. Yeah, but I understand, John. But if, if you really want to beat them... Yes. ...you need to do it the old-fashioned way. You need to earn it. And you know what? I'm going to give you a chance to make this whole thing right... <sighs> ...through the ancient battle... Yeah? ...of black versus white. Enough with the Ferguson. We already talked no, about no, it. No, no, John, John. I mean... What? ...through the magic <laughs> of chess. <laughs> I know, I know how to play the traditional cutting of the wires. <laughs> oh, I thought they'd go away, but they don't. It's, it's oh, there it goes. All right, very nice. All right. Okay, all right. Uh, because I'm white, I'll go first. Uh, all right. Uh, I guess because I'm Jewish, I'll go second. I, uh, pawn to d4. Oh, snap! Mousetrap! Checkmate! USA! USA! To be honest, between your cops and, uh, frankly, your Ebola... I, <laughs> I, 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 I... <laughs> your Ebola, my friend, it's not our... Believe me, he misspoke. You are from Africa. It's 